The first Saturday in May has a special meaning for those enamored with horses and thoroughbred racing. The Kentucky Derby, the oldest continuously running sporting event in the nation, attracts more than 150,000 fans. General Aviation serves the Derby, just as it does most major events in this country. Pilots and passengers pour into the small town of Louisville, changing the landscape for nearly a week. At airports, staff gears up for increase in traffic and gets into the spirit of the event by decorating with roses and preparing food for arriving passengers. At the cargo ramp, the most famous of the participants arrive, flying in from stables around the world on Air Horse One, a modified Boeing 727-200. At nearby GA airports, such as the historic Bowman Field, and Indiana's Clark Regional Airport, the FBOs know this is going to be a busy time. John Foley of ASI Aviation at Clark Regional sees an increase of jets flying into his normally quiet airport. So we had uh, 35 jets here on the ramp last year. This year we had 50 of them parked to, uh, to stay. And I believe we have serviced a total of 100 airplanes with fuel and or services. The 145th running of the Kentucky Derby in May 2019 was one for the record books. For the first time in its history, the winner was disqualified and the second place horse named the winner in a muddy race that fans watched in dismay in the pouring rain. Those who placed bets on Louisville trainer Bill Mott's country house made some money on the 65 to one long shot. Of course, the days after the race were beautiful and sunny, Perfect days to fly for the horses loaded onto Air Horse One early in the morning. Each horse has an individual stall on the aircraft and each is led on individually. They will munch on hay and complimentary water on their way home or to their next race. Julie Walker, AOPA Live.